1257, Altair at 92, passing the torch. But I have faith this codex will answer the many questions you have yet to ask. Altair, this gift is invaluable. Grazie. So, where will you go next? Back to Constantinople for a time. We will establish a guild there before returning to Venezia. Your son Marco will be eager to hear his father's wild story. Eh, he is a little young for such tales, but one day soon, see? Father, a vanguard of Mongols has broken through. The village is overrun. Nicolo, your cargo and provisions are waiting for you by the village gates. We will escort you there. Thank you, Mentor. Ready the catapults and watch for my signal. Stay close. He's 92 years old. This way. That's what I thought. Don't even attack me. Come on. Come on. Father, are you hurt? Uh, give me a moment. Yeah, but Altair had to be like 82 before he mastered it. Uh, the end of an era. When I was very young, I was foolish enough to believe that our creed would bring an end to all these conflicts. If only I possessed the humility to say to myself, I have seen enough for one life. I have done my part. Then again, there is no greater glory than fighting to find the truth. We are ready. A last favor, Nicolo. Take these with you and guard them well. Hide them if you must. Artifacts? Of a kind. They are keys. Each one imbued with a message. A message? For whom? I wish I knew. Oh, I, I'm pretty sure he'd be able to. I mean, he was a master. Passing the torch. Sequence 7 complete. Old boss, new boss. Forgive the haste of my handwriting, Claudia. Much has transpired, and little of it good. I am on a ship bound for Constantinople. No, you're not. The suit of a man whose treachery has eluded me until now. Prince Ahmed, Suleiman's uncle, is the man leading Templars here. He is the mastermind behind their Masyaf expedition, and he will stop at nothing to retrieve the keys, all of which are now in assassin hands. So what holds me back? Why do I not take the keys to Masyaf myself and be done with these fools? Because I have been careless. Because the Templars know about Sophia, and they're looking for her. Oh, Claudia, if anything should happen to her, I could not live with myself. I have dragged her into a war she knows nothing about. And it will be my burden to bear if she comes to any harm. Okay, then. Sequence 8, the end of an era... Almost done with this game. Probably another hour to go. And we'll be fully done. We're at three hours at that point. We're at two hours 27 right now. Right now we're at two hours 27. We've probably got another hour to go. We're going to finish this tonight. Citizens of the Empire and travelers from foreign lands take heed. By order of the Janissaries, new restrictions apply to all who travel to and from the city. Note that a reward of 10,000 Akche will be given without question to anyone who brings in information that leads to the immediate arrest of the Suikastje, Ezio Auditore.
has to do one damn favor. city rises against us, while Yusuf's murderer waits and watches from the arsenal, laughing. Fight with me, and show him what it means to cross the assassins. Oh boy. It's your time. Oh man, I wanted to travel here. This would be fun. Oh yes, thank you. Okay, Batman, calm down. Kill me and be done with it. I am sorry it had to come to this. Two men who should be friends quarreling over the keys to a library. We both strive for the same end, Ezio. Only our methods differ. Do you not see that? Peace, stability, a world where men live without fear. People desire the truth, yes. But even when they have it, they refuse to look. How do we fight this kind of ignorance? Liberty can be messy, Ahmed. But it is priceless. Of course. And when things fall apart, and the lights of civilization dim, Ezio Auditore can stand above the darkness and say proudly, I stayed true to my creed. I'd stab him in the head. I will open that library. And I will find the Grand Temple. And with the power that is hidden there, I will destroy the superstitions that keep men divided. Not in this life, Ahmed. Bring the seals to Galata Tower when you are ready. Do this, and Sophia will be spared. My brother's army will be here soon, Ezio. After that, everything changes. You just saw how we ran and gun we run and gun through the entire arsenal. How long have you been here? Long enough. I had Ahmed said as soon as he returned. But I never expected to hear of this. And what do you think? He is a sincere man. But this Templar fantasy of his is dangerous. It flies in the face of reality. The world is a tapestry of many colors and patterns. A just leader would celebrate this, not seek to unravel it. He fears the disorder that comes from difference. That is why we make laws to live by. A kanun that applies to all in equal measure. Shechtadem, stand back! Hold, soldier! This man is not our enemy. What a challenge it would be to have a son like you. You are not dead yet. Old friend, that's you. Spare my uncle if you can. Would your father? No. Suleiman the Great. Okay, I have no idea what's going on inside my room. And I wish they would move away from my door.
Okay, find your fellow assassins to ensure your safety during the exchange. Hey. Just gotta find everyone. Don't you know? That's what we do here. They should be outside. Galata Tower, which is right here. Like, it's right down the road from us. Mental. Pops, are you still there? Now should be a time for remembrance and mourning, I know. But our enemies do not permit us that luxury. Yusuf thought highly of you, assassin. And I find no reason to second-guess this judgment. Do you have it in your heart to lead these men and women and to maintain the dignity of our order as Yusuf did with such passion? It would be an honor. Bene, I am glad. Our enemy is... Close. Yeah, of course you're asleep. Take positions around the tower and wait for my command. As long as I don't have to do one of those stupid din defenses, I don't care. I think that was the worst thing they added to this game, was din defense. Like, oh, let's play tower defense. Yeah, that sounds great. Let's play tower defense. Okay, Batman, calm down, seriously. Makes it hard to call you a friend. Bloodlust. A strange insult from the man who ordered an attack on his own nephew. He was to be kidnapped, Ezio. Not killed. I see. Kidnapped by the Byzantines so that his uncle could rescue him and be heralded a hero. More or less. Now, the keys. First. The girl. <laughs> She's all yours. Sophia! Tell your men to back off. You could rescue her. You survive falls like that all the time. You survive falls like that all the time. I think anyone in this world can survive those falls. Yeah, thank me later. No, she just got hung. No, she's not hurt at all. Don't ask stupid questions like that. I did not mean to drag you into this. I'm sorry. And you're not responsible for the actions of other men. All this will be over soon, but I need to recover what they have taken. I do not understand what is happening, Ezio. Who are these men? Run! Just has to be a carriage right here. I think they're done screaming all of a sudden. 
End of the road. Ahmed is leaving the key city with the five MySF keys. Catch him before he escapes. Kill 20 guards. I can do that. I can do that well. We are close. Keep steady. Well, well. You have come to see me off. Hit that guy, and then hit that guy. Ow. Almost there. Hold on. Hang on, Sophia. Look out. Winds wind surfing, okay. Thank you. That guy's dead. God, okay, no, nope, okay. Sophia, you must be careful. No, I know. Don't tell her that, she just got hung. Woman got some problems Here now. Oh god, okay. Hi there. Almost done. So close to being done. Kinda busy. I'm going to go get food after Revelations is over. So what now, Ezio? How does this end? And then I might get I might play something else.
soldiers! Tell him he's not your master! You serve the Sultan! You carry out his command alone! Where is he? Where is the Sultan? He stands before you, brother. Father made his choice. <coughs> Tell him! Stop! Please! Oh, the thing. So, you are the assassin. Ezio Auditore. I am Selim, Suleiman's father. He speaks quite highly of you. He is a remarkable boy with a magnificent mind. Were it not for his endorsement, I would have you killed where you stand. Leave this place. Do not return. <laughs> you did the right thing, Ezio. This is not your fight. But where does one end and the next begin? Priorities. Sequence eight complete. Phil, good to see you. Listen, we've got a customs officer waiting to talk to everyone. I hope you have something for us. Absolutely. Passports and papers for everyone. Ah, brilliant. So I'm, I'm what? A neurosurgeon now, am I? You're a medical team from SUNY Upstate. Just back from Rome with your patient. Experimental gene therapy. Good work. Let's get this over with. Wait, look. This is crazy. What's wrong? I'm not sure, but Desmond's brain is lighting up like a string of firecrackers. Here it comes. What is that? What's going on? This is the end, Desmond. Scheduled for deletion. What are you doing? What is a man but the sum of his memories? We are the stories we live. The tales we tell ourselves. Don't do this. I'm saving you, idiot. Go! Go! these lines with a steady hand and a light heart. We are in Acre now, Sophia and I, with the five Masyaf keys in our possession and all the time in the world. Sophia is a seasoned traveler and a fine companion to have so far from home. Tomorrow we will make our way to Masyaf and once there, into Altair's library to fulfill our father's forgotten dream. Forgive the shortness of this letter, dear sister. For it is late, and we are tired. Perhaps, with luck, the next words you hear from me will be in person. Con affetto, Ezio. Do we ever get to see Claudia in this game? I forget that. A homecoming. Ezio and Sophia have arrived at Masyaf after many weeks of travel. Time to open that library. Such a climb. È così bello qui. This is where your order began? No. Began thousands of years ago, 
But here it was reborn. We know where it was born. The man you mentioned, Al Tair? Al Tair ibn La Ahad. He built us up and set us free. He saw the folly of keeping a castle like this. It had become a symbol of arrogance and a beacon for all our enemies. And the mandate for menacing hood? Was that his idea as well? <laughs> I like the hood. You mentioned a creed before. What is it? Nothing is true. Everything is permitted. That is rather cynical. It would be if it were doctrine. But it is merely an observation of the nature of reality. To say that nothing is true is to realize that the foundations of society are fragile and that we must be the shepherds of our own civilization. To say that everything is permitted is to understand that we are the architects of our actions and that we must live with their consequences, whether glorious or tragic. Do you regret your decision to live as an assassin for so long? Well, remember there we are. Decision. This life, it chose me. For three decades, I have served the memory of my father and my brothers, and fought for those who have suffered the pain of injustice. I do not regret those years, but it is time to live for myself and let them go. Let go of all of this. Then let go. You will not fall far. The end of the road. What do you hope to find behind that door? Knowledge, above all else. Altair was a profound man and a prolific writer. He built this place as a repository for all his wisdom. He saw many things in his life, learned many secrets, both troubling and strange. Knowledge that would drive lesser men to despair. Does that worry you? Sophia. You should know by now that I am not a lesser man. Uh, where does this one go? Oh, I can rotate them. Okay. Don't know why I thought that one was the answer. <laughs> There's four out outs on it. Answer, answer, answer. What do you hope to find behind that door? Knowledge above all else. Altair was a profound man and a prolific writer. He built this place as a repository for all his wisdom. He saw many things in his life, learned many secrets. Okay, that one goes there. That's a definite. Knowledge that would drive lesser men to despair. Does that worry you? Sophia. You should know by now that I am not a lesser man. Thank you. There we go. You had better come out of my life. I plan to. I'll go back and kiss her. Jeez. Yo, wimp.
just you, fratello mio. Requiescat in pace, Altair. Darim and Seth. You have been to my book. Yes. Some we sent with the Polos. The rest will go with me to Alexandria. Good. Very good. Father, I do not understand. Why did you build a library if you did not intend to keep your books? You should go. When the Mongols return, Masyaf must be empty. I see. This is not a library at all. It is a vault. It must stay hidden, Darim. Far from eager hand, at least until it has passed on the secret it contains. What secret? Go, son. Go be with your family. And live well. All that is good in me began with you, father. Much wisdom is much grief, and he that increaseth knowledge, increaseth sorrow. What does it tell you? What do you see? Strange visions and messages of ones who came before, of their rise and their fall. There we go. But what happens to us, Altair? To our family? What does the Atlas say? Oh, this is all the air. I was like, wait a minute. This is my duty, Maria. Maria. If you are asked, say I sent the apple away. Tell them I sent the cypress for Sipango or that I dropped it into the sea. Tell them anything to keep men away from this place. This apple must not be found. Not until the time is right. Sit a moment and rest. Oh, we're watching Altair, his final moments. Ninety two years old. I mean, it's kind of obvious where it is. Another artifact. No. You will stay here. I have seen enough for one life. Desmond? He's talking to me. I heard 
heard your name once before, Desmond. A long time ago. And now it lingers in my mind, like an image from an old dream. I do not know where you are, or by what means you can hear me. But I know you are listening. Finally giving it up. I have lived my life as best I could, not knowing its purpose, but drawn forward like a moth to a distant moon. And here at last, I discover a strange truth. That I am only a conduit for a message that eludes my understanding. Who are we who have been so blessed? To share our stories like this. To speak across centuries. Maybe you will answer all the questions I have asked. Maybe you will be the one to make all this suffering worth something in the end. Now, listen. That's good. And then the world ended.
And then the world ended. The earth shook for days. The fires burned for weeks. And when the ash had settled, less than 10,000 of your kind still lived. And far fewer of ours. But we carried on together to rebuild, to renew. Listen, you must go there, to the place where we labored, labored and lost. Take my words, pass them from your head into your hands. That is how you will open the way. But be warned, much still remains in flux, and I do not know how things will end, either in my time or yours. His vitals are stabilizing. Something's happening. He's... he's moving. Desmond, can you hear me? Son? I know what we need to do. What's up, William? Chapter 9, Revelations. And that's the end of this game, Assassin's Creed Revelations. It's been fun. It has been. We're going for 3 hours 18 minutes today. We're going to let the, uh, the credits go by as we normally do. Thank you to everyone who's watching this. And uh, yeah, it's been a fun game. I enjoyed it. I didn't like parts of it um but all in all it's a pretty good game it fits it definitely is a good lead off for the whole Ezio series and uh it's also a good like what's gonna happen next in the next episode the next game is um ec3 and we go to the american uh, revolutionary war meet george washington and benedict arnold and all those funds and that game's really boring it really is but we have to play it because it's part of it so we might just uh we might speed that game up just a little bit just to get through it faster. But yeah, it's day 128 of this stream. Thank you to everyone for watching. If you're joining us on Twitch, go to YouTube to watch the VODs of this. And if you're on YouTube, go to Twitch to watch us live, playing whatever game we're playing at the time you see this. 128 days straight. Yeah. Well, this has been Assassin's Creed Revelation, and I'm going to let the credits roll. And then I will be back to finish this whole thing off. Because I don't think we have any more quests afterwards. Um, unless we just want to do like the Hagia Sof uh, Sophia or whatever it's called. Uh, so we'll see when we get done with the credits. So we will see you then.